مشاهدينا الكرام اهلا ومرحبا بكم في حلقة جديدة من برنامج رواد الاعمال كما وعدناكم في كل حلقة ان نستضيف رجل اعمال مميز او سيدة اعمال مميزة رحب مع اليوم بميس ديانا صاحبة سوشي كلاب ريسترانت هاي هاو ار يو ميس ديانا هلو هلو اول جود ثانك يو ثانك يو فور هافينغ مي ثانك يو ميس ديانا كان يو تيل اس وين ديد يو ستارت يور بزنس سين اند انتروديوس يور سيلف يا شور سو ماي نيم از ديانا ماي سير نيم از شوباروا اي ام كازاكستاني يا ماي اوريجينال بروفيشن لايك ماي career is finance finance manager uh, I used to work here in UAE for five years and then uh, due to corona pandemics I started thinking that um, there is no actually safety in the work yeah. because if something unexpected like corona or anything yeah. else happens you're not Can, safe yeah. so I've decided that I need to open something of my own which will be an ex like a uh, side income which will be my safety and security in the yeah. future yeah i have a daughter i'm single mother so it was important that i am um, secured from uh, side space yeah not only from my uh, career and my professional uh, work mm. so i've started last year in november mm -hmm. This is when I've got the place. This is when I have signed the agreement, uh, uh, the trade license and uh, all the documents and the uh, legislative uh, uh, paperwork. Uh, we were able to launch only in uh, July because for this period of a bit more than half year, it was all about the paperwork. It was all about menu creation. It was all about testing food. It was a hard process. Um, it took a lot of uh, nerves, I would say. Yeah, but it you wasn't. <laughs> it wasn't easy. Yeah, but yeah. Uh, being being strong, being focused, being uh, stubborn, and working for my dream, I've, I've made it. And now it's almost half year that we're open. We're gaining our uh, market. We're gaining our loyal customers. Uh, we're gaining good reviews everywhere on delivery applications, on Google Maps, on all of the social networks. Um, so it wasn't easy, yeah. but we have finally made it. Alhamdulillah. Miss Diana, can you tell us what is the service that you provide here in UAE? Yes, yeah, sure. So uh, my idea initially was to provide sushi, mm -hmm. um, but we know here not everyone eats sushi. Yeah. So then mm -hmm. I thought that I should provide something which is quick by shareable food. So pizza is the perfect example of that. So once I started making a business plan, I I went through a lot of restaurants. I've uh, tasted a lot of sushi. I'm myself sushi lover, huge yeah. sushi lover. Me um, also. <laughs> yeah, I will try this one. <laughs> we will we will cook for you. <laughs> so um, I've tried a lot of places. I did not like because the way in Kazakhstan we cook, it's very much like um, I would say. Uh, Arab mentality as well, we cook a lot. Yeah. The portions are huge. Mm. Uh, we do not cook tiny, tiny Asian style, like four pieces, three pieces, just to try for the tooth. Yeah. We cook a lot, and when we eat sushi, we want to feel full. Yeah. We want to feel that, okay, now I've had a proper full meal, so I wanted to bring something here the same. Yeah. Uh, so I brought the team from Kazakhstan, from my own country, that can cook exactly what I like yeah. and uh, what I would want to serve here. So um, we're cooking uh, huge portions of sushi. We're putting a lot of um, cheese and sauce and they're very juicy, they're not dry. Yeah. Uh, we're having variety, different types of their, there are raw sushi, there are fried sushi, there are baked sushi, and all of them in huge portions and eight pieces in one. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> because mostly, most of the restaurants, they serve four pieces. Yeah. My goal was to serve a lot. Yeah. So that once you, and sushi are not a cheap product. Yeah. They are very expensive. And yeah. if you're paying this much money, That's you want to feel satisfied. Mm -hmm. You want to eat and you want to feel like Okay, I've had a good meal. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so pizza was like a complimentary to sushi, but mm. we've done with my team a huge research here. We've got uh, proper Italian ingredients. We are not substituting uh, them with any, I like flour, you can buy any flour. Yeah. But we're going precisely for Italian flour. We're going precisely for Italian cheese. We're going precisely for all the original pizza ingredients that make it Italian pizza, yeah. not just any pizza. Yeah. And the uh, uh, customer reviews that we're getting mostly about pizza is that most of the pizzas 
Uh, you can eat them only when they're fresh. Mm -hmm. Once you leave them for one hour, you cannot touch you it. Can, yeah. uh, our pizza, you can eat it next day. Yeah. Just heat it in the <laughs> microwave and have it fresh. Yeah. So because all the products, all the ingredients that we're using yeah. are genuine, they're expensive, they're not cheap, to be very honest. We're mm -hmm. not trying to make margin on, trying to save cost on ingredients. We're making margin on the taste and on the quantity. Yeah. So the margin is really small, but the quantity, we're, we are making our uh, life with quantity. Yeah. Not with a, with one time order margin. Yeah. So I believe this is what makes us really special. And we are all uh, Kazakhstanis mostly. Yeah. <laughs> we used to be Kazakhstanis, now we have very diversified team. Yeah. We are not like a team, we're like a family now. Mm. And that is what makes our customers enjoy the food here. Yeah, and have to come again, yeah. Right, mm. because we work as a team, we have this yeah, language family, together, yeah. uh, we're supporting each other. So um, it's not only the business that we're doing, it's al also the people that we're, we're only four. Yeah. We're joining together, they're like my brothers, I'm like their older sister. Yeah. So this is what makes us really special. Yeah, mashallah. Miss Diana, can you tell us about your future plan? The future plan, of course, it's extension. Yeah. <laughs> of course, we want another yeah. branch somewhere on the Cornish yeah. where more tourists are. Uh, mm. Of course, we want to have a bigger dine-in space. Mm. Um, but for now, we are still so new. Yeah, so. We are still focusing only on deliveries. We're still focusing on uh, making us seen on the market, yeah. making people believe in us, mm. gaining our market share, I yeah. would say. Mm. Uh, being here, not existing, but being and living the moment and uh, cooking for the pleasure of our customers. Yeah, inshallah. We hope you all the best, inshallah, Thank in the future, Diana. Thank you. Diana, as you know, there, uh, we are in the best country in the world. There's a lot of safe and security here. How does that help you to invest in UAE? Uh, that is a very good question yeah. because if I would be in Kazakhstan, I would be hesitant to do something like that. I would mm. prefer to stay employed because it's much more safer, much more secure. But being in UE, uh, you feel that the government is supporting you. You feel that all the procedures are really uh, legal. Everything is legal here. There is nothing yeah. happening under the table. Mm. Everything is fine and easy and very well explained. Everything by the book. You cannot go around the book, you cannot go over the book. You do everything how it is being instructed. So uh, this is what actually made it so easy to launch because I think if I would be doing it in my own, I would don't want to say anything bad about yeah. Kazakhstan. <laughs> <laughs> if yeah. I'm doing it in my own country, the, 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 the realistics of it. Here, yeah. the businesses are very much supported and we know that the tax system here mm. is much more advantageous than in other countries. Yeah. I'm not talking only about Kazakhstan. Mm. Everywhere in the world everyone knows that tax system here is very helpful yeah to any business to any resident to local people to everyone living and residing in UE so um, knowing that there are not many taxes mm -hmm. knowing that the government is giving you a proper instruction which if you follow correct you will get everything done on time yeah. and in a proper manner made me uh, feel very secure to start it mm -hmm. and also i should ask uh, i should add to this being a female entrepreneur yeah it's another thing because uh we are in a muslim country i'm muslim myself as well uh, ladies are perceived like non-business right yeah, people yeah. <laughs> business is only done by mm -hmm. Uh, man by gentlemen <laughs> so um, when I started it I did not feel for any second that I'm being in any way discriminated like where I'm being seen as a lady yeah. she's not able to do she's not no. able to deliver yeah. she's not, like mm -hmm. we should not consider her as a serious story as a woman case yeah. here yeah mm -hmm. but uh, here in UAE it was really simple really easy I didn't feel any um, distractions, I didn't feel any limitations. Um, everything went just simple and easy. There were some of the legal uh, boundaries there and here, like uh, having raw fish in the menu. Mm. So at first I opened as a cafeteria mm. and it was a mistake because cafeteria cannot serve raw, raw meat, yeah. uh, raw seafood. Mm. So then I had to change my trade license to restaurant to be yeah, able yeah. to serve because sushi is all about raw fish. Yeah. Of course, we could cook only baked and fried, but then it wouldn't be sushi yeah, anymore yeah, place. Yeah, it would yeah. be <laughs> cooked sushi <laughs> place. <laughs> so yeah, it's, it's because of 
me missing out the point. Yeah. Uh, not because it wasn't uh, uh, provided by the government to make it happen fast and easy. Yeah. Uh, Diana, can you tell us how to contact and reach with the Sushi Club restaurant? Sure. Uh, we are mostly working on deliveries. Mm. We are available on the Talabat, on the Livero. Mm. On Zamato, but now Zamato cut their service. Yeah. <laughs> we are on Eat Easy. We have our own delivery. Uh, we have a uh, mobile number, WhatsApp, Telegram. Um, we're mm -hmm. easily reachable, easily contactable. Yeah. Um, and of course, you can come in and dine in here. We're located yeah. in Ajman, Rashidia 1, opposite to uh, Ajman Free Zone Fish Market. Both of them. Yeah. And right beside <laughs> Nesta Hypermarket. Yeah, thank you. Thank you so much, Ms. Diana. Thank you. Thank you. And yeah. We are welcoming you to try now our yeah. food, right? <laughs> I want to make it to try it. <laughs> thank you. Thank you so much, Ms. Diana. مشاهدينا الكرام إلى هنا تنتهي حلقة اليوم. تابعونا كل جمعة وسبت على قناتكم. دمتم بخير وفي رعاية الله.